Welcome friends. Today we are going to talk about something that we have referred many times in the previous chapters that we have taken up. Like we had said when economic reforms were initiated or when liberalization took place such thing happened. So today we are going to talk about economic reforms in India. When India had attained independence we had a very protectionist type of policies. The economic policy that the government followed was very protectionist in nature. So, because of that, what happened was that in the la next four decades or forty years, we landed up in a big trouble. We were not competent enough to compete with the world market. Our economy growth was very slow. The technology that was used was backward, and it was felt there was a need for economic reforms. So we can say we were actually arm twisted to reform our economy, and that is when economic reforms took place. So we'll talk more about it, when, how and why were economic reforms introduced in India. So we are going to take up, we talk about that why they were initiated, in which all sectors they were initiated, we'll talk about the reforms in industrial sector, financial sector, external sector, tax reforms that were introduced, what has their impact been on the Indian economy and still what are the hurdles that we face. So let us first talk about that why economic reforms were initiated and why they became necessary for our country. 